So I am going to venture into Cracker Barrels, which is a retail location that has uh, food. They have breakfast, lunch, and dinner. They're nationwide. They have free overnight parking for truckers as well as non-truckers. They don't have showers. They just have food and they have a store. So we're going to check it out. So a little earlier, I spoke with the general manager and she got me all set up, telling me where the most well-lit place would be to park, as well as in direct line of sight to the security cameras. She showed me where the security cameras are on the building, so that's always good to know. So that is good news, and I'll show you where, how things are shaping up. More and more people are showing up as the sun is setting, which is pretty cool. I also introduced myself to other campers who are here, a couple in a Travado, so they are keeping an eye on me. More and more people are showing up as the sun is setting, which is pretty cool to see who's gonna be here. I'm looking forward to waking up in the morning and it's kind of like watching you know, flowers grow overnight, uh, wildflowers in a meadow. That's kind of what it feels like to me whenever there's a wide variety of campers all uh, part close together. You can see over here, there is the Blue Wonder and over there is the Travado, the couple that I befriended. And then a truck pulled up next to the Blue Wonder that is pulling a trailer. There's also a pretty sizable, oh, look at that one, that RV. That was pulling a car. And so we are forming a little neighborhood over there. Uh, I'm gonna get all cozy in. It's getting a little chilly up here in Asheville, North Carolina. It's getting cold. In just a couple of days, it's actually gonna be 17 degrees at night. And so I'm gonna be uh, filming how I stay warm in such cold temperatures. Uh, so stay tuned for that. But right now, well, let's just see how tonight goes in the Cracker Barrel. Well, everything's going very well here in the Cracker Barrel. It is silent. No, I, the road noise is just um, more like a murmur in the background. It's not a problem at all. Uh, and this is the Crowley location in Asheville, North Carolina. Uh, I'm surrounded, I peeked and a few more RVs showed up. I think there are about eight now of us here uh, and uh, it's just going to be a peaceful night, so I'll see you in the morning.
So this is the indoor temperature, actually. Uh, it says out there on the top left, but that's just because um, the it's using the sensor uh, that normally goes outdoors to detect the indoor temperature. And I slept very, very solidly. Not long, uh, but solidly. I stayed up a little too late uh, talking on the phone, but uh, it was a great conversation and I was excited to be here. And I'm just, now it is 6.40, I think, in the morning, which is about the time of sunrise here. It's a good idea and I think just good manners to patronize the store where we stay overnight. So uh, I did have dinner here last night and this morning I'm going to go ahead and have uh, some, some nice tea and oatmeal to start the day. And it's not necessary, you don't have to have both meals. I just was really, really hungry last night and didn't feel like cooking. Uh, so that's a really nice thing to do too. Well, all in all, this was a very successful trip here to Cracker Barrel in Asheville, North Carolina for an overnight stay. If you have any questions or thoughts, please post them in the comment section below and like and subscribe so that you can see more videos like this show up in your recommendations list. It's great to see you here and hey, stay safe on the road. You can do it. Enjoy your journey. Turn right onto US 19 South.